let's just do a short quiz on what we have learned till now in the topic supply first question if the supply of a commodity is perfectly elastic an increase in demand will result in a decrease in both price and quantity at equilibrium increase in both price and quantity at equilibrium c increase in equilibrium quantity equilibrium price remaining constant decrease in equilibrium price equilibrium quantity remaining constant the answer is increase in equilibrium quantity where the equilibrium price remains the constant i'll explain you how let's say this is a graph where on x axis we have taken the quantity and on y axis we have taken the price now the question states that the supply is perfectly elastic the question states that the supply is perfectly elastic that means it will be parallel to the x axis and we draw a demand curve this is the supply curve this is the demand curve so where they meet we call it an equilibrium point now what is happening is the demand is increasing so when the demand increases what happens is the demand curve shifts outward this is the new demand curve and it meets the supply curve at this point we call this point as e1 now what is happening at this point is we are seeing that the quantity supply rises from q1 to q2 the quantity supplied has increases sorry the quantity supplied has increased since the quantity demanded has also increased but the price is at its original level only the price has not changed so equilibrium quantity has increased yet the price has remained the same next question when change in quantity supplied is proportionate to a change in price the producer is said to have a perfectly elastic supply b relatively elastic supply c unitary elastic supply and d perfectly inelastic supply yes the answer is unitary elastic unitary elastic supply let's take that's the answer expansion in supply refers to a situation when the producers are willing to supply a a larger quantity of the commodity at an increased price larger quantity of a commodity due to increased taxation on that commodity see larger quantity of the commodity at the same price d larger quantity of the commodity at the decreased price now please remember that in this question we are asked about expansion expansion means increase in the quantity supplied due to an increase in price so the answer here should be a let's take that's the answer third when supply is perfectly inelastic elasticity of supply is equal to 
a plus 1, b 0, c minus 1, d infinity. What do you think is the answer? Supply is inelastic, perfectly inelastic. Perfectly inelastic means no change. And when there is no change, the answer would always be equal to 0. Next, supply refers to quantity supplied at a price for a particular period of time. A true, B false, C partly true, D none. Is this statement true? Yes, it is. Supply means quantity supplied at a particular price for a particular period of time. Unless you express the quantity supplied at a particular price and during a given period of time, the statement of supply would not be complete. So this statement is true. Next, when supply curve shifts to the right, there is dash in supply. When the supply curve is shifting to the right, Yes, it is an increase in supply because we've already done that change in supply means when the supply curve altogether shifts. When the supply curve is the same and we move along the same supply curve, it is either expansion or contraction. But when the supply curve shifts, it is either decrease or increase. And in this case, we are given that the supply curve is shifting towards the right. And when it is shifting towards the right, we call it an increase in supply. That's the answer. Final, short run price is also called as, it is called by the name of A, market price, B, showroom price, C, maximum retail price and D, none of these. It's the market price. In short run, what happens is, the price which is prevalent in the market becomes the price because it takes time for price to adjust itself but in short run it cannot quickly adjust itself so whatever price is the market price or whatever price is offered in the market becomes the price that's the answer